Hello and welcome to Start Research Classes. Today we are going to solve some of the questions from quantitative aptitude. As we all know that quantitative aptitude is one of the most important portion in any competitive examination and it raises your marks uh, at total. As you can you know that uh, there are several number of questions on it but they are mostly easy. Okay. Quantitative aptitude um, doesn't have any conceptual complexity rather than it requires your computational power and memorizing power okay so in this portion if you want to get more marks the key uh, the key um, strength which you need to increase is your practice and your memorizing and computing power okay so let's start with this portion. In each of the question, a equation is given, okay? and you have to find the values, the relation between x and y. We are given five relations here, and five sums are given corresponding to these five relations. For each of these, uh, for each of these sum, we have two equations on x and y variable and from these two equation we need to find the x value and y value and then we have to check the relation between x and y so start with the problem number 45 here we have first of all 4x squared minus 32x plus 63 is equals to 0 okay and this implies factorizing this quadratic equation we get 4x squared minus 14x minus 18x plus 63 is equals to 0 hence from this we get 2x minus 7 multiplied by 2x minus 9 Hence, x is equals to 7 by 2 or 9 by 2. Now, from 2, we get 2y squared minus 11y plus 15 is equals to 0. This is also a quadratic equation with variable y. And after factorizing this quadratic equation, we get 2y squared minus 6y minus 5y plus 15 is equals to 0 and this implies that y minus 3 multiplied by 2y minus 5 is equals to 0 hence y is equals to 3 or y is equals to 5 by 2 okay hence clearly here x is greater than y now jump to the next one question number 46 here we have the first equation implies that x cube is equals to cube root of 216 whole to the power 3 okay and this is nothing but 216 only therefore the value of x is cube root of 216 which results in 6 now from 2 we get 6y squared is equals to 150 hence y squared is equals to 150 divided by 6 which is nothing but 25 therefore y is equals to plus minus 5 hence clearly x is greater than y now jump to the next one that is 47 question number 47 here we have quadratic equations like 12x squared plus 17x plus 6 equals to 0. 12x squared plus 17x plus 6 is equals to 0. So after factorizing it, we get 12x squared plus 9x plus 8x plus 6 is equals to 0. Hence we can say that it is nothing but 4x plus 3 multiplied by 3x plus 2 is equals to 0 and x is equals to minus 3 by 4 or minus 2 by 3 and from 
2 so we get 6y square plus 5y plus 1 is equals to 0 and 6y square plus 2y plus 3y plus 1 is equals to 0 hence we get 2 factor 3y plus 1 and 2y plus 1 then y is equals to minus one third and minus half hence clearly x is less than y here now jump to the next one that is 48 here we have two quadratic equation also that is 2x square plus 9x plus 1 equals to 0 2x square plus 9x plus 1 is equals to 0 and after factorizing we get 4x plus 1 and 5x plus 1 therefore x is minus 1 by 4 or minus 1 by 5 and from 2 we have the quadratic equ equation 30y square plus 11y plus 1 is equals to 0 okay so after factorizing 8 we get 5y plus 1 and 6y plus 1 therefore y is equals to minus 1 by 5 or minus 1 by 6 hence here x is less than equals to y now lastly question number 49 here we have also two quadratic equations the first one is x square plus 17 x plus 72 x square plus 17 x plus 72 is equals to 0 which results in x plus 9 and x plus 8 is equals to 0 hence x is equals to minus 9 or minus 8 and the next one is y square plus 19y plus 90 is equals to 0 after factorizing we get y plus 9 multiplied by y plus 10 is equals to 0 hence y is minus 9 or minus 10 clearly x is greater than equals to y here okay so we have solved all the questions and that's all for today to know more about quantitative aptitude you can join us or you just can drop a message in whatsapp at these two numbers and they are 9836793076 and 9874822756 or you just can check our website which is www.sardosisclasses.com thank you very much